Hi everyone! Welcome to Salman Bashir, the channel! In this video, we will talk about what if lizard people ruled the world. Before moving forward, I request you to subscribe to this channel and turn on the bell icon. Let's start the video! Listen up, people! Your world has been taken over by extraterrestrial reptiles that can change shape. They have manipulated their way into influential positions. It could be anyone, really. We need to know the origin of these formidable reptilian beings. How might you possibly determine if someone is actually a lizard? But how can you possibly take down such mighty masters? Nearly 13 million Americans subscribe to the notion that a covert alien society controls the United States government. And many people think this group's influence extends well beyond American borders. Everything in the world is under their command. Those who believe in this hypothesis argue that these species have always existed alongside humans. Some of the most well-known people in the world are members of their cold-blooded race. These include Queen Elizabeth II and George W. Bush, to name just two. And these lizard people also run the Freemasons and the Illuminati and other secret organizations. As early as 1888, some were already convinced that a hidden race of reptilian overlords was running the world. One conspiracy theorist who has been accused of anti-Semitism has recently boosted its profile. Then, is it foolish to believe in foreign masters? Is it possible that what you're experiencing is entirely genuine? You should study their history so that you will be able to recognize the aliens among you. What you need to know is listed below. It's unlikely the reptilians have a terrestrial origin. They would have traveled from faraway solar systems near the Orion and Draco constellations. Once they got to Earth, they started mating with locals. Even our genetic makeup could be changed to conceal the truth from us. On the other hand, the leadership roles of these hybrid human reptiles would be short-lived. They'd rule until their reptilian forefathers came back to Earth. They'd rule by terror, spreading panic to normal people like you so you'd accept a dictatorial global government. Thankfully, once you know what to look for, these reptilians may be easily identified. Eye color changes, or chameleon eyes, are the first symptom. Obviously, that could be too difficult to pull off, what with lizard people having such sharp eyesight. Therefore, it's best to tread carefully among those that have blue, green, or hazel eyes. I have hazel eyes myself, actually. Second, keep an eye out for hair. Those sporting locks of a fiery hue. Or maybe just a little bit ruddy. In some cases, this may be conclusive evidence that a person is in fact reptilian. Possessing unusually keen hearing, the ability to destroy electrical appliances, and, of course, a history of contact with extraterrestrials are all red flags that call into question a person's claimed lizard ancestry. Right about now, your mind might be racing over a large list of everyone you've ever met who matched these inhumane characteristics. If you and a closest friend are filming each other, you might notice that one of them starts acting strangely in the middle of the clip. Yeah, you nailed it! They might rule the world like a lizard. You'd know the truth about them if only you could see past their facade. The split mouth, yellow eyes, and scaly skin. However, there is an even longer list of possible lizard characteristics. Among these include a fascination with outer space and scientific inquiry. There you go! The most telling and perhaps harmful gauge. But hold on a second. It's nice to know I'm not the only one with a passion for space and the sciences. You! That means it's possible that you and everyone you know is actually part of a lizard race that's in charge of the world. Then, what exactly could you do to reverse the situation? What do you think? Dark, cool environments are ideal for lizards. Get yourself out of your parents' basement and into a nice, shiny apartment as a first step. Water is another one of their favorite things. So, decline the invitation to the beach or pool the next time someone offers you one. 
If all else fails, you could always try making your own scent or fragrance to ward off any lizards in your life. To spice things up, give something with lots of hot sauce and pepper a shot. That ought to solve the problem. Maybe the best thing for you to do is to stop thinking about this conspiracy in such a naive way. Although entertaining at first, believing in such notions might seriously distort one's perception of the world. Besides, what if the aliens aren't externally dominating Earth, but rather internally inhabiting it? Thank you for watching this video. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel and share this video.